stirring up Phoenix terror has once again returned to Jerusalem. A bus bombing injuring at least 16 people. Black smoke billowing through the air, ushering in yet more fear this attack could bring a wave of more serious violence in the ongoing Israeli-Palestinian conflict. The bus aren't safe again, there's a problem, but I think this is, uh, this is common to me and to my Arab neighbours as well, we're all afraid. And uh, hopefully the things uh, will be better. Um, we shouldn't give extremists on both sides opportunity to rule our lives. Recently, mercifully rare, bus bombings were a lethal hallmark of the Palestinian uprising more than a decade ago. Today, though, no Palestinian group has yet claimed responsibility for the explosion. Police say they cannot confirm whether this was a terror attack, but Israel's prime minister appears to have decided. Benjamin Netanyahu pledging to settle the score with what he called terrorists. This explosion comes just over six months into a period of violence in which most of the attacks by Palestinians on Israelis have been stabbing and gun-related. So if this is the work of Palestinian militants, then it is a serious escalation and one that many people have been braced for.